Hi, YouTubers. It's Evan X with a bit of video. So, uh, it's a video now. So, I talk about based right now my health again. So, uh, or something I don't want to be. So, uh, essentially, talking about my health a lot on this channel. So, uh, you've seen the vlogs, you've seen the good for vlogs, you've seen the uh, health updates, uh, all that kind of crap, you know, this kind of crap. And basically, right now, we're talking right now uh, why I don't want to be like this. So, people have seen my weight vlogs, and, and every weight vlog, or almost every weight vlog, I talk about how I don't want to be like a bodybuilder, like a ripped, you know, muscly, you know, six pack bodybuilder you know all that kind of crap and uh basically you know people might ask me you know hey smoky ass you know you know why don't you want to be at in perfect shape you know why don't you want to be at an ideal weight which for me would be like 165 170 and you know do you realize if you were at ideal weight you would live a much 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 higher quality life and you would live much longer probably because eventually we're all going to die i mean it's just a fact of life so um and the answer to that is the main reason i don't want to be at ideal weight is because I wouldn't be happy. And in my opinion, the quality of your life is more important than the, qual than the quantity of your life. So uh, the quality is more important than the quantity. So, uh, um, I mean, obviously I wanna live a long life and that's why I'm not, you know, freaking, you know, fucking, you know, uh, 600 pounds. It's like, you know, people who are 600 pounds do not live a very long life. I mean, I'm not trying to make fat people hate here, you know, but I mean, uh, people who are 600 pounds, 500 pounds don't live a very long life. I mean, 30, 40 years old. I mean, can you imagine 20 years old as being middle aged? I mean, that's kind of, you know, fucking sad. I mean, it's just really fucking sad. And it's like, you know, yeah, I mean, I'm somewhat overweight. You know, I have health problems because I am overweight. You know, I am, you know, currently about 240, 241, and I have high blood pressure. I have uh, cholesterol issues, triglyceride issues, and also a uh, little bit of fibrosis in my liver, you know, fatty liver. But I'm not, you know, morbidly, grossly, you know, all that kind of crap, you know, you get the point, the freaking point, I mean, you get the fucking points, like, I'm not like, you know, 550 pounds, I can't even take a fucking shower by myself, it's like, you know, yeah, it's like, yeah, you know, it's like, you know, I'm still able to function, and really, when it comes down to it, if I was, like, 170, I really wouldn't be able to enjoy a lot of stuff, that being said, this is my whole point of the video, I would like to be a lot less than I am now. I mean, I would love to be 200 pounds again. I mean, 200 pounds is still probably technically considered, you know, quote unquote, technically considered obese. But I mean, 200 pounds, I wouldn't need blood pressure medication. I wouldn't need cholesterol medication. I wouldn't have a little bit of fibrosis in my liver. And I feel so much better. I feel a hell of a lot better. I mean, a shitload better. And I mean, honestly, yeah, at almost 30 years old, I'll be 30 years old next month, it's a little bit hard to be 50 or 60 pounds overweight. I mean, bending over is a little bit harder. It's no fun. You get out of breath a little bit quicker. And I know, I know people are going to say that it's smoking, but it's, I'm not going to talk about that kind of crap, you know, this kind of crap. You know, it's probably due to the fact I'm, you know, carrying around 50 or 60 extra pounds, 70 extra pounds. And yeah, it kind of sucks, you know. But if I was like 165, 160, 170, it's like, honestly, all I'd be doing is eating celery sticks, you know, and you know, well, not really, I'm kind of being over dramatic on purpose, you know, trying to be kind of silly ass like the big ass cigar, you know, but yeah, I wouldn't be able to enjoy a lot of things I enjoy because at 165, to maintain 165 at at basically 30 years old, because your metabolism is so much slower, you know, so much more fucking slower, yeah, I would have to give up a lot of crap. I mean, basically, virtually, you know, soda. I know people say soda's terrible for you, but I don't really give a crap. It's like, you know, really give a fuck. It's like, you know, and it's like, you know, I would have to give up so much crap. I mean, I would have to give up, you know, all the stuff I enjoy. Well, not for them. I mean, not entirely, but I mean, I wouldn't be able to do a lot of the shit I do right now if I was 165, 170. I was 184 in high school when I was a junior in high school, way before I started this YouTube channel. Well, not a couple of years before I started this YouTube channel. I was like 16 years old, 15 years old, or 16 years old. And I mean, it was sad when I was 184. I mean, I was really hungry all the time and I quickly gained back 10 pounds. And even at like 195, 200, I was a lot happier than I am now. I mean, I could still enjoy myself. I could still, you know, pig out a little bit. It's like, you know, enjoy your life. I mean, 
yeah, it might cut off a couple of years of your life, but you want do you want to be fucking miserable? I mean, do you want to be just like, you know, sitting there, you know, eating a carrot stick and not be able to enjoy a nice, you know, meal? And I know people are going to hate on the video, you know, and bitch on the video and say like, you know, oh, you fatty, you smelly fatty, you probably can't wipe your freaking ass, you know, you probably smell like freaking B.O., you know, I can't stand to be around your freaking ass, you know, all that kind of crap, you know, this kind of crap, you know, and you know what, people like that, screw them, so people who are, you know, haters on anybody who's overweight, screw them, you know, it's like, you know, but, you know, I mean, there are a lot of people who do, who do dislike people who are overweight, but it's like, yeah, when I was 184 in high school, it was not fun. I mean, it's like, you know, but even like at like 210 pounds, 220 even, which is 20 pounds less than I am now, I was so much happier. I didn't have the little bit of fibrosis in my liver. I wasn't on blood pressure and cholesterol medication. It's like, yeah, I feel a hell of a lot better even if I drop 20 or 30 pounds. It's like, you know, I don't have to drop like 100 pounds, you know, that, that kind of crap, you know, that kind of shit, you know. It's like, you know, the bottom line is, it's like, yeah, if I was 165, I'd probably add 10, 15 years to my life, but I'd probably be freaking miserable, you know, fucking miserable. It's like, you know, if I was 200 pounds, I feel a hell of a lot better, and I pro and I probably would add a couple of years to my life by redu by cutting my weight, you know, down by 30 pounds, even if I did, you know, met half that goal. So by you know, dropping 30 pounds as opposed to uh, uh, 60 pounds. So the bottom line is be happy. Enjoy your life. Life is way too fucking short. Enjoy it. Anyway, and for people who are haters on this video who are going to say, you smelly fatty, you smell like pit stains and B.O. and all that nasty crap, you know, screw you. So anyway, bye. Big ass cigar of life. Um,